What's up guys, welcome back to another episode of Destination Outdoors. On today's episode we're going to be squirrel hunting in Love Lady, Texas at Taylor's Grandpa's place. We're going to be using the old Remington 22, we got the GoPro strapped on, but we just pulled up here in the four-wheeler and we had one kind of jump over a tree right over top of us, but uh, we just parked. We're just going to kind of be walking around through the woods, seeing what we could find, maybe sit down in a couple spots, but uh, let's see if we can make it happen. We got one barking at us right now somewhere up in here. Yeah, I see. There's a squirrel nest right there. bucks yeah what was that three does yeah me and taylor riding right here on the four-wheeler traveling this tree line right here and one doe just ran out right here got up the camera and sure enough two more popped out did you see him smooth oh yeah wait 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 I don't know. Oh, I'm gonna try to push him back towards you. Did you press play on the GoPro? He's right up in here somewhere, laying down on top of one of these branches hiding from us. You gonna throw a stick at him? A little nest right there. Taylor said he saw something moving and we think he's sitting there. I'm gonna throw something at it, see if I can get him out. You ready? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was moving good. Like it moved and it stopped and moved and moved and moved and stopped. See it, see it, watch. I seen something. Like, oh yeah. You see it? He just like went up in it more. Oh, I just saw something. Yeah. He's definitely in there. See if you can get right here and throw something at it. Oh wait, there's just tail right there. Look. Oh yeah, come here, come here. See him? Oh, shoot. Yeah. Let me get on there. See right there? See him? His okay. tail's hanging out of there right there. See him moving? He's literally laying on the side of the tree. No. See him right there. See him? He's on the tree. The side oh, of the tree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You ready? Well, do you see him or yeah, just his no, tail? I see him. Wait, it's focusing. Tell me you're ready. Okay, I'm on him. Shoot him again, shoot him again. Shoot him again, shoot him again. There you go. Oh, there he is. He's stuck in the freaking tree. Wait. Oh. That one bounced off the tree. It hit like his tail. I hit his like butt. Yeah, he's stuck right there. He's dead right there. How are we so gonna? You just want to throw something at him? Down, yeah. I, I hit I hit his tail first because I I could barely see his butt. I saw what you were talking about that tail. That was a good eye. He was sitting up there in that nest right there, guys. He threw that last thing and he like moved a little bit. He's like an average size squirrel. Squirrel number one down. Here we go. Sweet. Number one. 
Got the little squirrel hanger. Actually, it's a duck hanger, but, yeah, but we're using we're it as a squirrel hanger man. today. Good deal. Sweet. Spot number two. We don't really have a spot number two. It's just wherever the next squirrel is, but <laughs> that's spot number two. Can you see? Yes. Yeah, Are you on? Hang on. I'm staying on him so we don't lose him. Fuck, he's out there on the end of that branch. There he goes. I bet he went in that damn nest right there. Did he run all the way over there? I don't know. He was literally above us, and I guess we just finally spooked him enough where he took off. Okay, well, you saw we just took off after that one, but we lost him. But we're kind of in a spot where it's hard to hunt squirrels and be able to video because they move so quick, and it's like when you got a shot, you kind of just got to shoot because it's hard to find them when they're uh, hugging up against a tree on top of a branch or something like his on the nest. He barely saw that one, but... We got a little spot where we can kind of sit down and see a little bit. We're gonna camp out right here for 10, 15 minutes, see what happens. All right guys, we're about to walk down this trail here. Maybe catch one or two more, we'll see. Ways. It goes all the way to our fence line, probably. A few hundred yards. Yeah, a few hundred yards, so. There's a big opening in there. We could probably settle in for a little bit and see. Ryan is walking around this tree. There was a squirrel right up here at this nest. I'll show you where he's at. He was like right up above that nest. But he's kind of just hanging low right now since we're... Oh, wait. Oh, there he is. Hey, come here, come here, come here. He's going to the top. He's going to the very top. Sitting up there, he's like, I don't even know, like 30, 35, 40 yards up there somewhere. But it's so thick right there, you can't even see. But he's just hiding up there from us. Okay, well, we lost him again, but we need to go sit in the deer stand here for too long. So we're gonna just start working our way back. And if we see another one, we'll shoot him. But that might be it. That's it. We didn't shoot any more squirrels, but I can't wait to cook this guy up. He's gonna be yummy on a pan with some grease, but that was just a short little episode of squirrel hunting in between our morning and evening hunts. We gotta, that's the only reason why we're stop squirrel hunting right now, because we're trying to get back in the deer stand. So Taylor can get his buck. But that's it for this episode of Destination Outdoors. If you liked, please leave a like and subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one. We out.